I think what you're saying is good when you have boys. What I think what when you have daughters, you should be a loving father. Because you Absolutely. are then setting a tone for the man to come in their life. 100%. Right? Totally agree. But a boy needs a man and tough love. 100%. That's one of my core principles in life, one of my core values and in our business, which is tough, honest love. Listen, we as men, as boys, we're wired totally different than females. I think a, a young girl should never forget the look of, the, her, of her father. She should never forget the look of the eyes of her father. Like, all a father has to do is just look at her and she's like, sorry, for us, that doesn't work. No. You can look at me, but you're going to have to probably <clears throat> whoop my ass for me to really understand the message that you're trying to get you're across. Right. And truthfully, uh, coming up as a kid, that was a lot of my upbringing. Made a mistake, got my ass whooped. Made another one, got my ass whooped. Got a lesson. And, and, but for a lot of us as boys, that's how we learn. We're hard-headed. Yeah. We're tough. But it's good that way because tough, hard-headed boys make for good, strong men when they learn their lessons. What's that saying, man? Tough, uh, tough times produces tough Tough times create strong men. Strong, strong men create good times. Good times create weak men. Weak men, yeah. It's a circle. Yeah, it is. Right now, we're on in, in weak men. Yes. There's, there's a lot of that going on, man. We're being stripped of masculinity. There's a lot of agendas being pushed from the left and the right on how men should be passive and they shouldn't be men. They shouldn't be strong. They shouldn't take care of their women. And they're also on the other end, women are being empowered to be men. So it's this very toxic cycle because men don't want to date another man, right? They don't want to date a woman that's just like them. That's, it's, there's nothing exciting about that. It's actually a bit repulsive to a lot of men. Like myself, I don't want to date that. I want the most soft, feminine, friendly, fit woman that I can find. And I will treat her like a queen because she's embodying an energy that I cannot embody. And she'll always keep me soft and keep me in, in a good place. Meanwhile, she wants a protector and a provider, someone that's going to take care of her and rightfully so. But we're having different agendas being pushed on us and it's, and it's hurting us in the big picture. I agree with you. 